Hey everybody, it's Robert. I thought I would do a quick video here to uh, show you the damage that was done to my F-86 this morning. Uh, you guys have probably already seen the crash video, so uh, after looking at the plane, the actually damage is, isn't actually as extensive as it looks. So I should be able to repair it, and uh, hopefully we'll get this plane back up in the air so we can shoot some more videos. So let me, let me dig in deep and show you what was damaged. It was damaged, and this will be an easy fix. The front little piece of the canopy which actually holds the battery hatch in. You can see this is loose here. So I should be able to fix that. I'm just going to hit it up with some um, probably either uh, hot glue or epoxy. I can fix that. And then the other thing that was damaged in the crash, it was crazy. Um, when the plane hit the ground, since the battery was attached to the speed controller, the speed controller completely ripped free thank God to little bullet connectors here it pulled right off the uh, pulled right off the motor itself so I should be able to hook that back up that shouldn't be a problem and then the only other damage to the plane as you can see here on the front of the plane here it's got where it struck the ground is actually got some foam wrinklage or what they call compression just been smashed in the ground here so what I'm gonna do is uh, I've seen some of the other videos online where they've dipped the foam in some warm water and that actually gets rid of some of the rippling so I'm going to try that and if I have to just touch it up with some paint this plane should probably be as good as new so stay tuned for more videos coming soon uh, I'll do a little uh, video blog of uh, how I'm repairing this plane and hopefully I can get it back up in the air so I can shoot some more videos